All right, uh, this is gonna be a quick little video about a uh, dupe guru. I believe I'm saying that right. Here's uh, the web page. Anyways, I'll put a link in the description, of course, and uh, for the links. So it's cross-platform, you know, Mac, Windows, Linux, 64-bit, 32-bit. And, um, you know, I used it on my desktop, and it worked really well. Pretty much what it does, um, well, the main purpose that I used it for it was to uh, uh, separate duplicate music files, right? So, like, you scan your music folder, and pretty much it, it'll... Uh, It'll separate, you know, the the multiple tracks or whatever, multiple names or whatever. It'll leave one behind. I believe it's the highest quality one, but then you can just go ahead and decide to delete it or move it to another folder. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna scan my uh, my what do you call it here? My passport, my little uh, Western Digital. All right, I keep a lot of my music on here, so I'm just gonna scan that, and I'm not gonna delete nothing. I'm just basically gonna move the folder out of it. So I'm going to start the program, and. Uh, it's pretty straightforward. It's not too hard. I've I've never uh, well, it was my first time actually scanning outside of my computer. I always did my my music folder, so I'm gonna see if it works by doing this. All right, so it says uh, select folder to scan. So you click the little plus button, and right here, of course, if you're you're on your uh, your your uh, what do you call it, your home folder, just click your music. And right now, I don't have any music in my home folder, so because I like I said, I keep it on my my external drive. So, anyways, um, right here's my passport, and here's my music click open and now it should scan right so scan click the scan button so now it's going to collect the, the files to scan and it might take a while so I'm going to go ahead and stop the video and uh, be back in a little bit okay so it's all done and basically like I said before it just it scanned my external drive so it does do that so it, it did work um, you can also of course you know scan just your home folder but anyways so here's the uh, the report, I guess, and um, I do have a lot of uh, duplicate files, and um, pretty much a lot of my music was given to me, you know, basically like payment, I guess, for working on people's computers and stuff like that. You just, you know, here's my iPod or MP3, you know, take what you want. <laughs> Anyways, um, yeah, you can tell there's no, it tells you the bit rate, tells you the size, you know, the megabytes, I believe, see size, yeah, four. Um, I don't know, it doesn't tell you the, the track name. I guess if you double click it. Yeah, and it should play. <laughs> really? Alright. Okay, so what I'm going to do is uh, basically separate these uh, duplicate tracks out of my main music folder. So it says view, I'm sorry, view, there's actions, right? You can uh, move mark or copy or uh, delete to your trash bin I guess right here Recy recycling bin so I, I gotta mark them all so mark all there you go and um, you know I should make a folder so alright let me go to my passport which is down here alright I'm gonna create another folder so let's call it I guess uh, what can I call it uh, I don't know M2 I guess music 2 whatever Alright, and um, let's see. Actions. Move to Mark 2. Alright, and we're going to put it at Passport. Here it is. M2. Open. And now it's moving. All files were successfully moved. Okay. Let's go back into that folder and see if it did the job. And there it is all my uh, duplicate files right so anyways that's just pretty much how you do it you know it's real simple to use um, I guess I would recommend just moving your files first before you actually make the the commitment to uh, deleting it just so you won't lose anything so anyways I'll put a link in the description to the download you know uh, this page right here and um, it's cross cross-platform like I was saying and works very well so anyways see you guys later